Shafiq Mohammed, 46, his wife, Bibi Shamiza Balkaran, and their three children, including their disabled son, lived in the lot 412 Success East Coast Demerara House. Police headquarters reported that the fire started at 2315 hours on Thursday. According to the police, Mohammed related that he was in the lower flat of the house cooking and he left his gas stove unattended and went outside to fill a bucket of water. Upon returning, he noticed that the kitchen was engulfed in fire. The newsroom on Friday spoke with Bibi Shimiza Balkaran, who said she was awakened by the heat. Upon noticing the fire, Balkaran said she rushed to rescue her son, who is living with a permanent disability. When, when they call for me now for concerning the fire, every time he could have me know me wake up in my sleep. When I walk down the step, from the step for come wrong now, the whole place was on fire. But I could have run off and grab this little boy. The whole house get dark. I barely recognize this boy by the door, by the room door. And all I know, I, I grab he and pull he. Me don't know how I reach on the step or how I reach, to be honest. The fire has left Balkaran and her family displaced. Mohammed is seeking shelter at his mother's house while Balkaran and her three children are staying at a neighbor. Balkaran said she cannot afford to rebuild a house. Because my house it was, was a well, new house with like well furniture, stuff. yes, well furniture everything. Mm. What work your husband do? Well, right now he does sharpen blade by mommy. Blade. Because he recently um, injured his back and then he left the job and then in that he get a slight shock on the eye. So he do two surgery in six months. So he not really stress the eye, but he does sharpen a little blade for, you know. An investigation is ongoing to determine the cause of the fire. Reporting for the newsroom from Success, I am Shard Bacchus.